All right, thanks, Brian. Um, yes, MCL's back with another new product presentation. As uh, if, if you've been around for the, uh, for the last three years, twice a year, we've been doing new product presentations. This is the result of uh, dedicating myself and my chief engineer solely to uh, a, a extensive R&D program. Okay. And so I'm going to introduce today uh, two of our latest uh, M-Shield products. These are the all-in-one uh, fire, water, sound, movement expansion joints. The first is the WFR3, which stands for Wall Fire Rated 3 Hours. The second is the SJS FPFR2, that's Seismic Joint System for Plaza Decks, Fire Rated for 2 Hours. So to our... Uh, Architects and engineers, we want you to specify with confidence. Uh, one of our initiatives has been to move all of our product validation, internal validation, to third-party testing. So the WFR3 starts with UL and ULC listings under UL 2079, which is a very vigorous uh, testing that involves both joint cycling at uh, normal wind sway and thermal levels, as well as at seismic frequencies, followed by a two-hour fire test and a hose stream test. The system has been hurricane resistance tested per ASTM E330 uh, up to 200 miles per hour, both positive and negative wind loading. Sound attenuation per ASTM E90 with uh, sound transmission class of 62 at minimum and OITCs of 52, which if you're into acoustics, you know that's extraordinary. Uh, the Air Barrier Association of America compliant according to ASTM E283, watertight per ASTM E331 which is uh, wind-driven rain spray with a negative air pressure on the backside. And everything's manufactured under UL's follow-up service. So only companies with, uh, who manufacture under the follow-up service can actually carry the UL symbol. We have symbols for Canada and the US. Um, this means that we allow UL into our factory unannounced at any point that they want to at any time to ensure that, uh, to validate that the product we're shipping you is made exactly the same way as the stuff we ship for testing. If the fire blankets, other products you are specifying or using are not UL listed, there's no guarantee that's what, that what is being shipped is the same as what was used in testing. So for installation, the product is available for joints from a half an inch all the way up to four inches. And the whole concept behind these products is that you have one product that does everything. Soundproofing, fireproofing, water protection, movement. It's installed from one side, fire rated from either. You can have a different color on each side. The key to the performance of the system is a new fire retardant impregnation chemistry that we've developed over the last 15 years, combined with an intermescent shield and then a silicone facing for color coordination and waterproofing. It installs quickly at inside corners, head of wall, wall to wall. Um, there are no uh, screws, anchors, no drilling, so working at inside corners or in slightly obstructed areas is not a problem with the system. Joins are very quickly and easily made. Uh, they connect to our M-Shield deck systems for continuity of seal and for complete, complete compartmentation and fire protection. Uh, it eliminates completely the need for multiple product installations. So you might be using up to two or three systems now to achieve all of those performance results. You can do it in one single installation step. The second product, uh, SJS FPFR2, is the first ever split slab uh, fire rated listing issued by UL. It's for joints from 4 up to 10 inches with 100% movement. So to pass this, this joint had to be cycled from 5 to 15 inches, uh, both at seismic rates as well as the normal thermal cycling rates. As with all of our FP systems, they're designed to integrate with a static uh, connection to the structural deck waterproofing. And this allows then for the pavers to come up to the system. Uh, it has a built-in to our fire rating. So you will not ever again have to go underneath the deck to install a fire blanket or a gutter. It's waterproof at the top surface. The cover plate is non-invasively anchored as far as the topping slabs are concerned. And as you know, the cover plate anchors always break up. This is anchored entirely to the spline that is part of the, um, part of the assembly uh, that comes with the system. You do, as I said, you installed entirely from the top surface. This was a job where the contractor showed up to install a fire blanket. There was no access to the underside of the joint because all of the uh, electrical and mechanical had been done. Um, all of these obstructions prevented the installation of a blanket. Uh, this job had already uh, been monocoat, had been applied as a fireproofing on the structural steel. This meant that to attach a fire blanket, all of that had to be scraped off 
the fire blanket shot into place with, with Hilti guns and the, and the monocoat sprayed back on. We eliminate that completely. No lifts, no scaffolds, no overhead holding labor. Um, a three-man operation to install a fire blanket, working around co uh, electrical conduit and everything else. As with all of our FP systems, we supply factory fabricated transitions, both in the metal components, you see the T, uh, the T system here, as well as in the side flashing sheets to ensure water tightness and integration with the deck system. The FP is set into and anchored uh, into an epoxy mortar bed. The face of the joint is butted with a epoxy adhesive. The entire assembly is shipped pre-compressed to less than the joint size to remove the packaging and uh, discard the shrink wrap and the hardboard. It comes with pre-installed hanger bars that uh, help you with handling. Hold that, lower it down into the joint. We're starting at the T in this installation. You can see how the product is expanding into where the T will connect. So you lower it in and the hanger bars uh, set the system right at the level that it's uh, required for performance. Uh, we're joining to the first straight length. We're pushing that into the side of the connection with uh, joining it with intumescent and silicone. Uh, joins in straight lengths are made uh, through a combination of spreading an intumescent coating across the join as well as uh, silicone across the bellows face. All of the UL testing requires that a field executed join be part of the cycling and burn test so you can be assured that that works. Uh, the next length is slid into place, so pin aligns the two and uh, we tool the silicone into the bellows. Remove the hanger bars, inject a sealant band and lap seal silicone, reinstall capping strips, tie in the flashing sheets into the deck waterproofing, install the wear course, the concrete, the pavers, etc. And then the cover plates go on. This is a custom laser cut T to start the installation. The screws are self tapped into the spline that comes as part of the system, so there's no hole locating, it, it falls where it, it fits. And then you apply the, uh, install the, the other cover plates and the system is essentially complete. So who's using M-Shield? Uh, you're not the first and uh, you're not alone. Uh, we have already over 30,000 feet of our M-Shield systems in place on over 165 projects in 38 countries on new construction and retrofit in airports, schools, prisons, hospitals, stadiums, malls, and just about every other building you can imagine. Um, the M-Shield family of products over the last three years has now grown to include for decks and floors our DFR 2 and 3, 2 and 3 hour rated systems. They're trafficable, they go into joints up to 4 inches. The SSF 2 and 3, these are security seal for floors, this has a pick resistant coating on it. For again, joints from, uh, these go about half an inch up to 4 inches. The seismic joint system, both one and two hour rated for joints from four to 10 inches, and now the SJS FP FR2 for plaza deck split slab systems, and in walls, WFR2 and three, and security seal for walls, which is a two hour pick resistant coating on it uh, for security applications. Everything you need to select, specify, and submit the M Shield and all of our other products is available on our website. Product information, UL listings, test data, installation instructions, guide specs, CAD drawings, project profiles, videos and more, including online chat is now new at mseal.com. Uh, if you go onto any of our product pages, you'll see in the top right corner, live online chat available. You click that button and you will be linked. You can select by the region of the country you're in to one of our dedicated uh, inside tech guys that services your area. You click that, you hit the start chat button and you have a quick uh, a live exchange. If you're looking for something on the site and can't find it, these guys can email you CAD drawings, uh, tech data, uh, everything you need to shorten your, uh, your search time on the site. And with that, that is it. Thank you. Any questions? Do I have a one? How did I do? Very good. Very good. 10 minutes? All right. Excellent. I'll take questions afterwards. Thank you.